a lot of these uh, Game Jam games downloaded. And before I do anything, let me actually... Summer of Shivers, Game Jam. Let me let me get this link because I like to, to share this and pin it here in case anybody wants to take a look and they can find all of the games there for themselves as well. It says there are 80 entries. There were 81 last time I checked, so I don't know if something got removed. Um, but the popular entries move around a lot. Like, every day they're different. Um, and a lot of them we've already played, some of them we haven't. It honestly makes me want to try and play through every single game in this list. But with 80 entries, that's going to be very tough. We already played 10. And currently downloaded, I had like another 14 or 15. I'm not sure which one to start with. I think I'm just going to... Let me just dive right in. I'm going to go to the bends. So the bends is uh, something that happens when you... When, when you dive, when you scuba dive, uh, the nitrogen in your blood, um, because you're obviously under pressure, you it, it kind of compresses. Um, oh, 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 it's popping up. It's popping up. Let's go. So the nitrogen in your blood compresses. And then when you come back to the surface, it expands again. Um, so you need to let that nitrogen out of your bloodstream. And if you come up too fast and you don't let that happen, you can very easily die. Um, if you come up too fast, if it's an emergency and you come up too fast, basically what you need to do is call somebody or hope maybe there's a facility nearby and they will get a helicopter hospital, um, basically, uh, an ambulance, a helicopter ambulance, and they will take you to uh, an actual compression chamber and they will put you in there as if you, and you know slowly right raise it back again um and and as if you were under the pressure of water so they have to do that if you come up too fast you get what's called the bends sometimes it's not as bad if you come up you know a little bit too fast and you weren't that deep for that long you should be okay but you might still get like a headache and and it's going to be all sorts well the bends is what happens when you come up too fast so uh with that bit of information let's dive right in play a game Hey, it's a controller, flashlight, zoom in, walk it, oh no, not the music, that controller is creepy, and it says H, HPS1, HSP1, is that triangle X, circle square, HSP1, okay, HPS1, haunted PlayStation 1, we have the run on the L1 maybe, let's just try, Okay. Oh. What's the matter with the chain? Is it the arm? Uh, sorry, Ari. Is there room to disembark? I need to lower the volume on this one. It seems very, very loud. For me as well. Okay. Hold on. Slow down now. We can jump. Yep. Flashlight is here. We can zoom in here. We can, I don't know what this is, but that's on square. No, it seems like can't hear you. He can't hear us. I love this design. So what's happening? I can get back to the lift. I can't run. Sometimes the light's kind of in my way, making it a little bit too bright, so. I'm trying to uh, not use it all the time. Let me get back to this lift then. I can't get on the lift. Hmm. Okay. Alright. Okay, let me uh, just move my video over there. All right, let's get going. This the glare on the light is like in my eyes, and it's uh, it's good because it means that the the flashlight, which usually you just always want on in a game, maybe we don't want on all the time now. This square, this is what it does. I every time I press it, it just does that. But it's uh, it's weird. I don't know what it's for. I didn't read it on the on the control. In fact, maybe 
I pressed, I pressed select, I pressed select and it turned the game off. Have a, that's a self-destruct button. Not good. Let's, uh, let's start again. <laughs> and hopefully, uh, walkie-talkie, oh, that's what it is. And it's doing it incorrectly. That does close game. It actually does close the game. So, that's not good. Whoa. Okay, let's go. Run. Run. How did we go into the game last time? Okay, it worked. <laughs> Just pressed enough. Okay. Right. I can disembark. Okay. There we go. We disembark and then we wait. Slow down now. I'll read the comms check. So that's the comms. We have no comms. Now, it seems I can't hear you. Blast this faulty equipment. Well, back to the list or can for the rest of that. Seems as if you still hear me. Must be a short. It's a shot, okay. The best way out now is to get you to the high rise, just past our cave. Don't fret about the airline. You're still in safe hands. Okay. Let's have a look, shall we? We can run. There we go. On L2. Look at that. The weird pixelated graphics in like this 3D environment is super creepy. So we have to go up to a cave, he mentioned. I don't know if this game has enemies. I don't know if this game is going to have jump scares. I know nothing. Right now, I'm just completely blind. And uh, that's the scariest part of a game. I can hear the... Behind me, it sounds like very creepy. Can we get up on here? We can't get up on here. It doesn't do anything, though. Let's just keep going, shall we? I wonder if we're going to have to hide from any giant wildlife or creepy things. Any Lovecraftian entities under here. Whoa. Okay, it looks like we're going into the fog. This is always the scariest part. And then once, once you see an enemy or you realize, like, how to avoid it or... Or fight it or whatever you need to do. That's, you know, the, the fear starts to fall away. But right now? No, it's tense. Right now it's tense. We're going to stay tense. <laughs> it's hurting my shoulder. Oh, shoulder's been killing all week. Horror games are not good for my, uh, <laughs> for my back muscles. Let's, uh... Looks like we went the wrong way down here. Let's let's work his way back up. Okay. There's, there's some huge source of like noise behind me. Whoa, I can see. Are these pile are these ships? Yeah. These are uh fighter ships. I'm gonna turn it up again. Turn it back up. He's he's kind of whispering to us, and there's a lot of audio. Move you off there. Hmm. Oh. Okay. What is this? More? Is that a missile? Oh. He told me off for flickering my lights. <laughs> a weird interaction I didn't expect there should be a gap wide enough for us to reach you along even here trust in the mission and it will be once only into the breach okay into the breach a fantastic game if you've never played into the breach and you like strategy games that you are missing out it's like a uh, ooh ooh Oh, what is that? It's like a glowing eyes or something. What the hell? Okay. 
Let's go away from there. I don't like that. Into the breach, yeah, it's a... What do you mean there's no sound from the bilge pump? Is it the float switch? Is it working? Is it, where could it be? And where could it be? Oh, fuck. Where could it be? Alright, I'm gonna keep walking, dude. I know you guys are having trouble up there, but, um... Eventually... Oh, excuse me. I have O2 now. I'm running out of oxygen. Okay, that was scary. Um, how do I get more oxygen? Or do I just run? How do I get more oxygen? This is not good. Okay. This, this, uh... This, uh, j jam had two... But usually, usually a game jam has like a theme. Oh my god, what is that? It's like static. It's Sin from Final Fantasy X. Oh, it's creating static. I don't like it. No, let's just try and get away from that thing. Um, there are two themes that you could choose from. One of them was um, public service announcements, PSA. And you know, do whatever you want with that. And these were only optional themes as well. It was really just a Summer of Shivers horror low poly game jam. And uh, the... Oh, we've run out of... Oh, the lights are back. Well, there's some more eyes. On a rock or whatever. Looks like... It looks like a monster on the wall. Looks like a giant spider. It looks like a giant spider. Oh! It was. It was. It was a spider. Okay. Okay. No, 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 no. Do we have to do anything specific? Oh my god, no. Just keep going. Just keep going. Just keep running. And the other theme was... Sub mechanophobia or something like that, and it's basically um, uh, like kind of a mix between claustrophobia and being underwater, and and it basically imagine being trapped in a submarine. That's that's like the core of it. Um, what are you? What's that red stuff over there? Am I going towards that red stuff? Because that doesn't seem safe. We're going somewhere we don't want to be going now. Okay. 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 We don't like this. This is a, this is a human structure. What structure is this? What the hell is this? This should not be under the water here. Okay. The music's creepy as well now. It knows what it's doing. It's getting us. It's getting us nice and tense. Don't jump scare me. Oh, they're all spikes. That's spikes. We're entering a mouth or something. Oh my god. The low draw distance is very effective. What is that? It's behind us. Why did that look behind me? Never look behind you. Oh my god, we, we fell. Life is full of second chances. We fell. Oh no. No, 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 no. I looked behind me and fell to my death. Never look behind you. Oh no. Oh, you didn't. You didn't send me all the way back here. That's not good. That sucks. That sucks. That sucks. Hold on. I'm not holding on. I'm going. I'll be the comms check. No. Do you call? No. I'm running away. I'm not waiting for you. I'm trying to get to the end as fast as again. Now we were. I think we were near the end. No. It seems I can't hear you. Blast this faulty equipment. He's jumping faster. Back to the lift. Let's see what you know games where jumping or rolling is faster? Why do they do that? Why has any game ever done that? And then you just have to tap the roll button the entire game or the jump button and hop your way through it like an idiot. I don't know why why they do that. Always make the run button faster, strength. Well, this is not a... You see, now, now that we've got to do this again, the second time you have to go through an area, unless it's going unless it's going to be different and we don't know yet we don't know for sure that it's not going to be different it could be um 
you know, it could be... It doesn't look procedurally generated or anything in any way, so I'm not really that scared because I think pretty much the same things are going to happen. That's where your fear just gets stripped away. Doing the, Going through the same area, doing the same thing. You see too many of the same monster, like in Tortured Souls. It was uh, it was cool. It was scary at first, but then it was very much not. Oh, no, it wasn't because I was flicking the lights. It was just a, a, a scheduled thing. Okay. Nah, that's a shame. Okay. 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 Yeah, so that was, uh, that was not something that was <laughs> my input controlling anything at all. It was just, uh, something that was always gonna happen. That's the thing again that we see. Bilge pump. I, I guess that's the that's our oxygen pump then. Are you a good swimmer? No, we're walking. We're in heavy metal boots. Come on. Why do you need an elevator? Can't you just lift me up by the the wire connected to my head? Can I not just hold onto the helmet and you'll pull me up? That seems like a good option right now, to be honest. Where was the spider? Wasn't the spider on this wall here? Where is it now? God, it's running through this same area really does strip anything. Because <sighs> if we die again, that's the end of this game, right? I'm not going to run through all this again. So we better do it correctly. That's what I'm saying. There's the static. Oh, we're only here? We haven't got to the spider yet at all. Damn. Yeah, this is awkward. This is a little bit awkward. Horror games don't play well with that. Hello, spider. Hello, spider demon. You know, spiders are not supposed to be underwater. You should get out of here. Bye. You should get out of here. Underwater spiders, oh my god. I actually am not scared of spiders. I, I don't mind spiders at all. Um, when I was younger, I was going to have a pet tarantula, but I actually ended up with a pet snake. Because um, I, I love like things that people think are creepy. Spider, some spiders are really cute. Oh, in fact, the game webbed came out like yesterday on Steam, where you're the little spider. Oh man, it looks so good. Webbed. I need to. I need to download and play. There are so many games to play at the minute. Today, the Rewinder came out. If you remember, I did the demo for that. It was like um, you were you were helping souls cross or something, and we were um, we had to do the puzzle with a weight, and it took me took me forever. Oh god, I just stop scratching my leg, and my O2 is gonna run out. And um, with the weights, and I kind of got a little bit stumped. That game was awesome. That was a rewinder. That's out today. Also, Lost in Random came out today. Action Adventure with rolling dice and cards and stuff. That looks awesome as well. And then soon, Aragami is coming out at the same time. What else is coming out? Something else is coming out on the 17th. WarioWare came out today. Um, I've got to play Webbed. I'm going to be reviewing Top D and 2D and Top D now, which uh, we're going to be playing anyway. So that's great. It's just so, so much to play right now. It's it's crazy. I, like, don't have time for anything. I just... I want to take, like, a full two weeks off of work and just... You know what I mean? Just, just play. I don't think I can do anything here. Can I... Can I jump? I don't want to fall. Ah! Oh! It tricked me! It tricked me! I jumped onto it and it went away! Oh, I'm not doing this one again. It's just a lot of walking. Okay, that's the end of the bends. Unfortunately, I, 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 I'm not walking all the way there again. There could have been a really awesome ending, but I'm going to assume that there wasn't. That was the bends. 